Oh, there we go. Helps if I have the microphone unmuted. Jeez Louise. Hi! Uh, hi! Hi, dear. Hello. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. I'm not dying anymore. Hooray! I yes! I can watch you play Fallout under the influence of, uh, I, what were you under the influence of? Uh, Ciproflexin. Ciproflexin? It, yeah, that's what it is. So, the, uh, uh, the hypothesis of, um, of, uh, Melinda Lynn Kyle, you've seen her in the chat, uh, she's a nurse, and she was like, you are really out of it, uh, what the hell is going on, and I told her, uh, this is what the thing is, and she's like, well, the body processes antibiotics in interesting ways, and a lot of it gets broken down into, uh, sugars, uh, and then the body has to process that, and sometimes that can lead to a semi-intoxicated state. Uh, <laughs> because that's, you know, that's what the liver does, and when it breaks down alcohol, it turns into sugar. And excessive sugar, that's what leads to the hangover, so. But yeah, so that's, uh, that's, uh, it's officially out of the system. Yes, that's right, K-Dog, no more hi, Tom. So, for those of you who saw me play- Hi, Tom! <laughs> hi! So if th those of you who saw me play Fallout and Sea of Thieves, um, I'm sure that'll make its way into the hi highlight reel because that oh, was, dear. uh, that was, uh, <laughs> boo, he says, aww. Aww. That was, that was, uh, that was, um, an interesting thing. And I went back and, like, watched myself play a little bit of, uh, Fallout while I was still- under the influence and even in that condition i was like oh my god i did that one i'm surprised i only died once and two i was just like i was really that messed up so if there was any new viewers during those nights like what's this guy's problem does he just like get hammered and just stream or something like, no, <laughs> that's not what goes on so it's going to be even more confusing if those people come back it's like hey this guy was what's what <laughs> what's going on it's like he had a bad day at work he just had to do something you know just just to get the shaking to stop just to take the edge off or something like that let's send out a tweedly d all tweedly right a little so yeah so that's a thing so uh we're back to undertale and as as you were explaining to me this is where the game really begins it's true the truest so. of games Yep. So uh, we've uh, we we somehow got through Flowey's uh, instant death trap of absolute ridiculousness. Showed him compassion and mercy, even though he killed Asgore like a dick. God, he's like the 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 worst thing in the world. Uh, and now we're somehow just before uh, having to fight Asgore, which begs the question: uh, Do we even have to? Yeah, well, the answer is uh, we're gonna go. We're gonna go. So we're gonna we're gonna go to um, the waterfall place. We're gonna we're, go to that scary fish house. We're gonna go to the. Oh, we're going to Undyne's house. Yeah, we have to go to Undyne's house. Okay, then let's go to Undyne's house. All right, let's do this. Please understand. You downloaded. It's good, it is good to hear you from you, though. That thank you. It's excellent to hear from you. With your your melodious voice and 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 your world renowned pipes, and K Dog wow. says he downloaded Plumbers Don't Wear Ties, and I want to know why. Uh oh, is that uh, a bad uh, game? It is a game that was released for the 3DO, which is already uh, off to a great start. Mm -hmm. Great uh, start. And it was a. Um, I'm pretty sure this was game was supposed to be pitched as a party game. Because it's supposed to deal with two people that are trying to, like, get hooked up for a date, and they keep <laughs> score and everything. So I'm pretty sure the, the concept was a bunch of young, hip 20-somethings get drunk, and they all try to play this game just to try to get these two to pair up, you know? And, yeah, lamest porno ever. That's exactly what it is. Um, but the thing is, it starts out with full motion video, and then after the intro cutscene is done, it's all still frames with voiceover. 
Oh no. So what I'm thinking happened was they kind of blew the budget on the actors mm -hmm. and only had enough money to film the beginning and then they just took still photography and then just had them overdub the lines because they couldn't like it, it it's it's a joke. It's <laughs> it's it's really a, a bad bad joke. But the funny the, the, the funniest part about it is there's a part towards the end where the the, the main good guy is professing to the the, uh, the lead girl and he's like I don't want you just for one night I want you for every night or something like that but he flubs his line and you can hear people around the set laughing at it and then he says the line again so it's an intake of an outtake Oh my god. No. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Oh my god. That's awful. The PC version shows nudity. I didn't know there was a <gasps> PC version. Nipples. Um, yeah, well, there's like... The Angry Video Game Nerd did a video on it a long time ago. And he said there was actually a cheat code to remove the sensor bars. And he says, you can do that if you want, but all you have, but you'll be looking at this dude's hairy ass the entire time he's in the shower. <laughs> and I don't know if anybody really wants to do that. Mm. So we're back outside of the thing with Asgore and Toriel is here. So everything's going to be fine because Goat Mom is here and everything's going to be great. So, you know, it's interesting. You know, like how like Night Trap got like re-released in like mm -hmm. HD and everything. I'm surprised that same company that brought Night Trap back uh, isn't going to do something stupid like that. Like find like the uh, the uh, the 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 footage reel from Plumbers Don't Wear Ties and actually like you know like oh this is found footage. We actually have cutscenes again for the whole game. That would be hilarious or wow. not. But you know it's added irony. Night Trap is coming to the Switch. What? Yes, and it's You're kidding me. Totally serious. It's happening this summer, probably alongside the rumored Xbox One version. But here's the real kicker about that. Limited Run Games is getting the opportunity to publish the physical version of it. So you have a game that was originally oh. only available on the Sega CD, which is oh. now being released on a cartridge. It all has come full circle. <laughs> and that game sparked a controversy. It did. And the in the electronic software ratings board. Oh my yeah, god. It's, I cannot believe that Nintendo's like, yeah. Yeah. Let's let's do that. Yeah, because I I because uh Howard Lincoln who is one of Nintendo's big wigs at the time, got up on Capitol Hill and really started throwing mud at Sega, saying, I can't believe they would let such a thing be released on their platform where children could play it. And now... Yeah, exactly. Quote, Night Trap will never be on Nintendo. And <laughs> <laughs> were his exact words. And wow. now... 25 years later... <laughs> <laughs> The bad thing is that game is not good. No, it's like, not. Ferret has an unhealthy obsession with it, but it's really not that good. Um, the game it, is actually really hard. It's like unnaturally difficult. Yeah, and and it doesn't help that all of the timing is based on keyframes that you can't even tell. So you kind of have to guess when to activate the traps and you miss a lot. But here's the real kicker. There's actually a story going on when you're trying mm -hmm. to catch all these bad guys. So if you actually try to pay attention to the story, people are going to start dying. So mm -hmm. it's badly designed from that aspect too. So if you actually want to like understand what the frick is going on, people will die. So supposedly in this version, they spaced it out a little bit more so you can actually find out what's going on if you really want to. So that's a thing. That's a thing that's happening. So let's all let's all put our collective hopes and dreams together and hope that plumbers don't wear ties get the same treatment. Because that would be hilarious. So do you know where we are going? Um, well, Sands isn't here anymore, so I guess... So you're gonna take the elevator? Okay. Story, there's a story. Shockingly. <gasps> story? Yes, story. 
It's very quiet. Oh, here's another elevator. <coughs> Bo the the really long elevator that has its own soundtrack. Uh, and you can stream Plumbers Don't Wear Ties on Twitch. Oh, so the game is actually listed. Somebody get me a 3DO oh, and a copy man. of the game, and I will fly three other people in, and we'll play it all on the couch. Who would you fly in? Uh, you, um, probably Danger Boy John. <laughs> yeah. Um, and, uh, Kelly. I, th I think that I think that would be a pretty good mix because That'd like be dope. because John's been tending bar as as a new job, and apparently he's very good at it because he likes a drink to begin with, you know, mm -hmm. to put in the wheelbarrow and go to Dairy Queen. And um, oh, can I take the oh, elevator here too? I think you take, yeah, you can take this elevator all the way down. Yeah. I think so. I, I think that would be a uh, a good thing, and uh, we'll try to get the best ending or the high score or something like that. And all the proceeds will will go towards uh, some charity. We'll we'll figure out. That'd be super dope. It would be super dope. I I think that would be a very funny weekend. Is a note? Hey! Yeah, you don't need to read oh, that. Oh, we already did that. Okay. Kaneko's note. Kaneko's note. Oh, I need some nice cream, yo. And I'm oh. so happy. Nice cream is really changing the world. Oh, that's right. He, he sold it all. That's right. He sold it all because he's such a great success. Hey, guess what? I still oh, have my all God. my dog. Because this was before the fight. We get to keep the dog salad. Remember when we grinded for dog salad? By the way, grinding for dog salad will be playing at games this weekend. No cover charge. You just made the list. Oh my god. Grinding for dog salad. Grinding um, for dog salad. Uh, uh, don't go this way. Oh boy. So, oh dear. Yeah. Yeah, go left. So I've been listening to a lot of uh, Undertale music since we've started this this oh hello oh hello metaton looked really really cool in that dress it sort of makes me feel like i could wear one too mm. okay fuck B B it's what? Buster. <laughs> hmm? he just like dropped the f-bomb at a very casual f did I pay for Coleg? Yes! Yes! We totally. Coleg. Yeah, we went. We, that was like, if everything should ever go wrong in the rest of this game, if we somehow got the genocide ending by mistake, which which we haven't. You couldn't. I tell you that. It is not, it is right. not a mistake. <laughs> You're right. Well, I'm just saying that if everything should ever go wrong, we sent Temi to Coleg. Mm -hmm. And I can go to bed peacefully at night knowing that I did that. Hey, Moffat. Yeah, there you are, dearie. You always are welcome in my parlor. Just stay on your best behavior. <laughs> oh, so, how, how is how is Moffat doing in your bed, by the way? Oh. <laughs> Look, I came home, there was one crawling on my bed sheets, and then when I woke up, there was a jumping spider near my head. So, life's real interesting. What about that, I went ahead and what about forth. that flamethrower I sent you? <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah, I poisoned all of my walls, by the way. Oh, dear. Uh, I think... I... I wanna... Uh, I, I, I screwed up already. I wanted, I wanted to think there was an easier way than this. No, don't go that way. You have to go left. There we go. That wasn't too bad. We, Keep going. We have a couple of birthdays to celebrate today. I know it's Chad motherfucking James's birthday. Today? Today is Chad James's birthday, yes. Man. Yeah. I think you need to go down to L1. Left floor one. I think it's left floor run. Yep, I paid for Coleg. Uh, yep, I'm not high, Joe. I'm sorry. It's officially worked its way out of my system. Dang. Yeah. Which is always funny because I... So now you want to go south. Now I want to go south. Because, like... Oh, hello, River Sticks, dude. Yeah, we're going to go to... Tra-la-la, I am the Riverman. Do you know the Riverman? 
Do you know the River Man? Oh, it's Chris. Or am Sa I the River Woman? It's Chris Sabbath's birthday as well. Vegeta. Mm. Vegeta. Love to ride in my boat. But not, the, cares, but, but, but not the real Vegeta. Oh, oh did I say that out loud? I'm sorry. <gasps> <laughs> Where will we go today? Go to Waterfall. I want to go to Snowden! No, I want to go to Snowden! A papyrus! A papyrus! So, um, uh, yeah, Undertale music. Did you see that Undertale rap? The, the one that was in 3D? Uh, I don't think so. Welcome. Did you watch, did you, did you watch the, um, thing I sent you, like, a while ago? The, uh, under, if Undertale was real or something uh, it, it's actually using those same models <laughs> and it was just like the, the model that they have for Sans and Papyrus is so freaking good cause like they're hanging out with the kid taking him around Snowden it's like dude you took a wicked fall I don't even know how you got this far it's crazy but you've got this rap down to the bone and then Papyrus just turns to Sans and say are you serious you ended the line on a pun. It was a good pun. It's like, it was actually. It, it's pretty great. You didn't win the Saturn game. You lost by 50 cents. Oh, jeez, that sucks. Wait, what? Uh, Joe was in a bidding war for a super rare game on the Sega Saturn, and he found it for a stupidly cheap price. Aww. Yeah, so my heart goes out to you, Joe. All right. Uh, take a... Oh, whoops. Whoa there! Be careful out there, kid! Wow! I can't remember if it's to the left or the right. Yeah, throw away... Put some dog salads into your box. Or should I put using my cell phone-y? Mm, I do. Dimension. There we go. There we go. <coughs> Sweet. Excuse you. Yes. It's not oh, yeah. rare that right you place. wanted it. Oh, what was it? What was the game, Joe? Oh, hello. That, oh, that's oh, that's what's his dude's house. Naps the bloop. There he is. Hi, buddy. Ugh. Uh, I'm gonna keep working on that mix CD. Okay, that's cool, bro. Nice to see you. What's up? All right, you? I'm gonna need a drink before I we start this. Okay. Because it's going to be. Okay, you get a drink. It's going to be a thing. I'll be right back. Well, Shelby goes to um, get herself a drink, I'm going to uh, use the men's room. So how about that? Yeah, bodily functions. BRB. Yaki Yukin Special Joe, are you for real? Is that what you were bidding on? <laughs> Tom, I messed up. Tom. Tom. Hello. Hello, chat. How do you do? How do you do? It's just me and you. And you and me. And pans everybody. Thank you. Thank you for uh, liking my swimsuit. I also like it a lot. Because uh, I got it. I got it for pretty cheap. And I have never worn it. I haven't worn a one piece since I can like remember. I've always worn two pieces. Um, it's nice. Um, I feel like I took some overexposed photos, unfortunately. And man, my thighs be chunky. Gotta work on that. Correction, I was pissing. Oh. Tom, I've made a mistake. You made a mistake? Yeah. You know, like the worst, um, the worst thing that to happen in a house is like you like when you're like, oh, I'm gonna go get this, I'm gonna go get like a box of cereal, or I'm gonna go get some chocolate milk or whatever, mm -hmm. and someone someone leaves um, like a, the box in there, but there's nothing in there. I just did it to myself. I did it to my 
myself. I live alone. I did it to myself. That's that's no bueno. I need to lecture myself now. Like I can't believe. <laughs> Are you gonna put you... yourself in timeout? Are you gonna put yourself in the corner? <laughs> I'm spank myself, apparently. Whoa! <laughs> That'll be a sub stream. Yeah, uh, right. Mm -hmm. Subs only. Sub now. Subs only, chat. Exactly. Okay. Oh, Here who's that? Goes. You don't want to know how Chris Jericho found out he was replaced in the casket match by Rusev. Did he, uh... Did he, did he find out on Twitter from Rusev? <laughs> what? 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 <laughs> K-Dog says kinky. I'm a sub. Ha ha ha. Ha ha. Jokes. Jokes. It's a living... That doesn't even make it's sense. A I guess it's, it. it's a living. It's a living. Oh, the human arrives! Are you ready to hang out with Undying? I have a plan to make you two great friends. <clears throat> Will sure. you hang out? Absolutely. He got a text saying he's no longer in the match? Oh my god, that's so unprofessional. Okay, stand behind me. She loves these. It's a bone. Hi, Papyrus. Ready for your extra private one-on-one -on -one training? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Talk about kinky. I guess so. Well, he was texted asking if he wanted to do the match. Oh, so this... You bet I am. And I brought a friend! Hi, I don't think we've... Uh-oh. Oh! Uh -oh. uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you two come in? Question mark? Come... Well, this is awkward. <laughs> this is this is really really. What was that? <laughs> oh, you wait. That's a big sore in the corner. Here, Undyne. My friend brought a gift for you, on their own and totally not with my help. Uh, thanks. I'll um. Put it with the others. Oh dear. Oh. <laughs> so are we ready to start? Uh, whoopsie doopsie. I just remembered. I have to go to the bathroom. <laughs> okay. You two have fun. What? what? <laughs> Get out, everybody. We're done. <laughs> We're done. I, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so this is how I feel emotionally right now. But I'm just, I'm sorry. Toriel, Toriel, for the love of freaking all that is holy, what is happening? Toriel. Shelby! Yes? I'm freaking out. <laughs> it gets better. Oh, oh, this is not getting better. She's figuring it out. So why are you here? To rub your victory in my face? You were dying. I gave you water from the water machine. To humiliate me even further? No. Is that it? No. Then why are you here? <sighs> hmm. Wait. I get it. Oh, God. You think that I'm going to be friends with you, huh? I was hoping so. Right? <laughs> really? <laughs> How delightful. I accept. <sighs> okay, see? It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. We got this. We got this. Let's all frolic in the fields of friendship. Is that sarcasm? Not.
I can't even. <laughs> Tom, I'm... we're not even. We're not even in the beginning of this. What? <laughs> oh my god! Oh, Tom, you don't, don't even know. You don't even know. How's my audio, by the way? Am I fine? You sound clear as a bell. Why would I ever be friends with you? If you weren't my house guest, I'd beat you up right now. Can we for a boss battle? <laughs> You're the enemy of everyone's hopes and dreams. I'm sorry. You thought you were doing the right thing. You didn't know what was going on. I will never be your friend. And let, just let me hit my head in the back of my chair in disgust so hard that it knocked my goddamn headphones off. Oh. You're tearing me apart, Undyne! <laughs> God damn it! Now, get out of my house. This is... this sucks. Oh, uh, please! Dang, what a shame! I thought Undyne could be friends with you. But I guess I overestimated her. What? She's just not up to the challenge. <laughs> challenge? What? Papyrus. Wait a second. Darn it. Hey, language. He thinks I can't be friends with you? <laughs> what a joke. I could make friends with a wimpy loser like you any day. Oh dear. I'll show him. Listen up, human. We're not going to just be friends. We're going to be besties. I'll make you like me so much. You won't be able to think of anyone else. <laughs> it's the perfect revenge. Why don't you have a seat? <laughs> oh, man. My heart rate is currently at 103. <laughs> this is, um, this is, uh, okay. I, I really don't know what, um, I don't know whether to say Papyrus is that smart or he's just that lucky or what happened because <laughs> this seems like something out of a, yeah, I guess it is, Kiv. Sit down and progress. <laughs> I, that's not really so much sitting, but okay. Comfortable? I'll get you something to drink. All set? What would you like? Oh! Hey! Don't get up! What the? <laughs> You're the guest! Sit down and enjoy yourself. You broke the table! <laughs> um, uh, why don't you just point to what you want? You can use the spear. I can choose Undyne! Uh, I can choose Undyne! Hello, man. Hey, the fish has a name! <laughs> Point at the fish, you three. Sugar <laughs> goes in tea. Sickly yellow li Oh, it must be Mountain Dew, then. Soda. You're thirsty for dead fish! <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. I'm gonna break your feet later. I guess so. Hot, Hot chocolate. Green cylinder? What? I don't know. That's blue. Obviously blue. Ah. Fridge full of food. Tea box. Completely correct choice. Well, 
What happens if I choose Undyne? I don't know. Do your thing. Are you thirsty for that fish? That seems really awkward. <laughs> Kanye West. <laughs> LOL, you're a gay fish! Can All you right. point at the sword? Yes, you sword can. Acquired, acquired taste. taste. What she order, fish fillet? Oh dear. Hey Matt, they opened up a Ford's Fish Shack over on Belmont Ridge Road now. They're expanding. Hmm. Yes, you wish to drink the sword. I would like to drink sword. Blatantly correct. <clears throat> oh. <sighs> Wah. <laughs> you should go. You should both go. Enjoy angry muscles. I th think of me. Wicked pissers, Shelby. Wicked pissers. Wicked pissers. Wicked, wicked. How much is that $50 lobster roll I always get? Mm. Is it? It's not $50. It, well, it's it's market price. And every time oh. I get it, it's always in the off season. Because oh, it's yeah. right after MAGFest. And it's like a hajillion dollars. So it's always like 50 bucks whenever <laughs> I do it. But you know what? It's within the company of you guys. Which makes it worth it. So, so worth. Yeah, exactly. Hashtag so worth. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um... Do what's in your heart, Tom. You're gonna be you're gonna be besties. Blatantly correct choice. Why does it say green cylinder? I don't know. What does it say when you scroll to Undyne? Undyne select with oh. me. Are you hitting on me? Uh, oh, well, that, <laughs> that didn't work. Tea, huh? Coming right up. That wasn't awkward at all. I regret that decision. Ah, <laughs> uh, it'll take a moment for the water to boil. It's a slide whistle sound effect. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's all done. I love how she's sweating. She's just nervous. She's 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 playing the game. Here we are. It's gonna fall right to the middle of the table. <laughs> it's the, <laughs> this is the feeling that I'm going to get. That's just the impression that I get. Have you ever had to knock on wood? Because I know someone who has, which makes me wonder if I should. I'm glad I haven't yet, but that's just the impression that I get. Here we are. <laughs> <laughs> Careful, it's hot. Oh, dear. It's not that hot. Just drink it already. Wow, just settle down. Did I see Caddy's new video? No, not yet. I had to go ahead and get set up for everything because I have to rearrange the studio to do PC stuff. It's it's burning. You take a sip of the tea. It's burning. It's burning. But other than that, it's pretty good. Nice. It's pretty good, right? Pretty, pretty, pretty darn good. Pretty, pretty, pretty good. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Nothing but the best for my absolutely precious friend. Oh my god. I won't agree with one of his opinions. Guess what? That's what they are. They're opinions. Everyone's got one, just like an asshole. Whether you want it or not. Hey! That was something that happened when I was on the Ciproflax, and it was like Drano. Oh. For like five days of seven. Yeah, because it, cause it, uh, it kills it, your oh, gut bacteria. It, yeah, and and, and it, it, it was so bad that the, uh, the pharmacist said, if you are going to take any probiotics, wait like three hours. Otherwise, it'll all die like <laughs> as soon as you eat it. Oh my god. It's about ukulele. 
Okay, if he's talking shit, I'm sorry, Grandma, hold on. Language! If he's talking garbage about Capital Casino as being the best song in the entire game, I'm gonna be mad. What? Um, ukulele is a uh, remarkably inconsistent experience from start yeah, to finish. Yeah, I understand that. But it's a good game, Kappa. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but the it's a one, good game, Tom. Yeah, uh, they're good games, Brent. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but the one thing that I feel that is remarkably consistent throughout the entire game is the soundtrack. Mm -hmm. and uh grant kirkhope knocked it out of the park but my favorite song in the entire game is the song from the casino level capital casino i actually like hook like go to youtube hook that up to my bluetooth speaker and blast that while i clean the living room studio it's 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 really good hmm. caddy actually thinks ukulele is good and loves everything but cart toast net of that's fine. He can he can say what he wants. I love ukulele when it's being banjo kazooie. I hate it when it's trying to be everything else that Rare's ever made. Mm. You know, it's it's a rare vival. Okay, focus on one thing. Too many cooks in the kitchen. That's what mm -hmm. it was. Focus on one thing. You don't have to do everything. That's why you can make more than one game. Mm -hmm. You can make more than one homage. Did that ever occur to you guys? Right. Right. Mm -hmm. Anyways, right. so this hey. is their their end all be all. Yeah, exactly. They're doing one Kickstarter in one game, and they're done. <laughs> yeah. Hey. You know, it's kind of strange that you chose that tea. It was the only one that you had. Golden flower tea. Oh, like the ones that I fell on. That's Asgore's favorite kind. Um... Actually, now that I think about it, it kind of remind me of him. Really? Uh -huh. You're both total weenies. That's very rude. Sort of. <laughs> you know, I was... A uh, pretty hot-headed kid. Once, to prove I was the strongest, I tried to fight Asgore. Oh, I'm sure that went over well. Emphasis on tried. I couldn't land a single blow on him. And worse, the whole time he refused to fight back. I was so humiliated. And that's how you got promoted to the head of the guard? Afterwards, he apologized and said something goofy. Excuse me, do you know, do you want to know how to beat me? Be a nice guy. I said yes, and from then on, he trained me. One day, during practice, I finally knocked him down. I felt bad. But he was beaming. I had never seen someone more proud to get their butt kicked. The student has become the teacher. Anyway, long story short, he kept training me. And now I'm the head of the Royal Guard. Oh, so then I'll, yeah. So I'm the one who gets to train dorks to fight. Hashtag dorks to fight. Dorks to fight? By the way, Shelby. Dorks to fight will be playing at games this weekend. Do you know what a dork you know is? What? Whale's you penis! <laughs> <laughs> That's uh, right! Peaks. Mm -hmm. Like a uh, papyrus. I'm sure you mean well. What's up, Radio Spider? Radio Spider! Spider! He is our hero. But, um, to be honest. Lexi flops out of the Tinder's guy car into the stream chat. Did you have a car date, Lexi? Uh, <laughs> with a car? I didn't know you were car sexual. Uh, she loves automatic transmissions. I, mean, <laughs> I thought you would like stick shifts. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Got more to please. You put in that overdrive gear, I'll tell you what. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Going turbo. <laughs> You've had multiple. Whoa! Multiple Context. orgasms? Good. Hey, home run. <laughs> Run around the bases. 
were hanging out in his car. Hanging out in the car. Right? In the back seat. Although something strange happened tonight. Oh, wait a minute. Happened tonight. Hey, it's driving and chill. You leave her alone. Mm-hmm. <laughs> While Tom... Hey. I'm just saying, which is something that you should never say, because that's setting yourself up for all... Like, whatever Craig would say that... Hey, I'm just saying, I'm, just I'm saying. like... I'm just Look, like... it's not racist, but... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, safe home, Vern Troyer. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, Mini-Me's no longer with us. Oh, yeah, I heard about that. Yeah. Uh, my favorite uh, role that Vern Troyer ever played was actually not Mini-Me, or him being the spokesperson for Sega when they launched the Dreamcast. But, uh... uh hey, Tony's here! What's up? Hey, Tony! How's it going? Yeah, uh, but, um... Uh, you know the actor Bruce Campbell. Um, Bruce Campbell! Bruce he, Campbell! He had a, uh, uh, a TV show in the late 90s, early 2000s, where he was playing a member of the Secret Service... Uh, that was sent over uh, to France uh, by Thomas Jefferson to keep an eye on Napoleon as he was conquering Europe. It was called Jack of All Trades, and I love that show. It's really specific. <laughs> right, but like, to, to, and it didn't, the show didn't take itself very seriously, but it was a generally serious show because it dealt with espionage and all that fun stuff. But the one thing that they did not take seriously at all was that they casted Vern Troyer as Napoleon. Hmm. So you had Mini Me as Napoleon, <laughs> and it was yeah. That's fucking yeah. Wow. It was it was pretty crazy. All right, so but uh, to be honest, to be honest, I don't know if I can never let Papyrus into the Royal Guard. Oh, that's harsh. Don't tell him I said that. And he's probably outside the window right Hi, now. I am dying. Are you going <laughs> to let me into the Royal Guard now? Yeah. <laughs> He's just, well... Not with it? I mean, it's not like he's that weak. Skellington! Skellington! He's actually pretty freaking tough. It's just that he's... He's too innocent and nice! I mean, look, he was supposed to capture you. I'm alright, Radio Spider, thank you for asking. He ended up being friends with you instead. I want everybody to be my friend. I could never send him into battle. Well, that's awfully considerate of you. He'd get ripped into little smiling shreds. That's part of why... I started teaching him how to cook, you know? Oh, spaghetti! Spaghetti! You touch my spaghetti! Someone touch my spaghetti! So, um... Maybe he can do something else with his life, like date humans. Yeah, that was... Well, that went over really well for us. Oh, sorry. I was talking for so long. No, you're fine. You're out of tea, aren't you? The tea is probably still really hot. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get you some more. No, I'm good. Thank you. Why are you just standing? Oh. Wait a second. Papyrus. His cooking lesson. He was supposed to have that right now. Oh. And if he's not gonna hear, not if he's not here to have it, you have to have it for him. Uh... That's right. Nothing has brought Papyrus and I closer no, stop than it. cooking. No, Tariel, help me. Which means that if I give you his, uh, give you his lesson, you'll become closer than you can ever imagine. <laughs> Afraid we're gonna be best friends. I am terrified. What? Stop it! <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> she palmed you like a basketball. Good lord, <laughs> she's freakish and strong. Let's start with the sauce. Envision these vegetables as your greatest enemy. Now, pound them to dust with your fists. 
you punch the vegetables at full force. You knock over a tomato. Yeah! Yeah! Our hearts are uniting against this healthy ingredients. Now it's my turn. Yeah! Oh my god! Um, <laughs> uh, I'll describe this into a bowl later. It's all over her face! <laughs> You know the part in Kill Bill? Uh, no, not Kill Bill, uh, Sin City. Oh, yeah. Where she kills the guy and just, yeah. oh my god. But for now, we add the noodles. Homemade noodles are the best. But I just buy store brand. Oh my god. They're the cheapest. Yeah! Um, just put them in the pot. How will you put them in? Friendly? Careful. Fiercely, sorry. You throw everything in the pot as hard as you can. Clean <laughs> the box. Fine <laughs> fiber. It clicks against the empty bottom. Yeah! I'm into it! Now it's time to stir that pasta. As a general rule of thumb, the more you stir, the better it is. Ready? Let's do it. Z, 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 Z. Stir harder! Jam that turbo! Harder! Harder! Ugh, can you do it? Ah! Now for the final step. Turn up the heat. This is not going to end well. <laughs> Let the stovetop symbolize your passion. Let your hopes and dreams turn into burning fire. Ready? Don't hold anything back. Don't hold the right. Yeah. Hotter. We're gonna burn the house Water. down! Water, darn it! Water! Wait, that's two. Game <laughs> over. <laughs> Don't give up, Jenna. <laughs> oh, and I burned her face. Ah. Uh, man, no wonder Papyrus sucks at cooking. <laughs> So what's next? Scrapbooking? Friendship bracelets? Oh. Who am I kidding? I really screwed this up, didn't I? I can't force you to like me, human. Some people just don't get along with each other. Don't say that. I understand if you feel that way about me. I don't. And if we can't be friends... That's okay. Because... If we're not friends... It means I can destroy you without regret! HEY! I've been defeated. My house is in shambles. <laughs> I just told you it was gonna be a boss battle. God damn it! <laughs> I even failed to befriend you. That's it. I don't care if you're my guest anymore. One final rematch. All out on both sides. It's the only way I can regain my lost pride. Now, come on. Hit me with all you've got. Dinah's letting you make the first attack. Show me what you've got. You pretend to swing it and die with all your might. What? That's the best you can manage? Even attacking at full force. You can't... Just can't muster the intent to hurt me, huh? Huh. <sighs> You know what? 
I don't actually want to hurt you either. At first, I hated your stupid saccharine shtick. Oh, shtick, huh? The way you hit me right now, it reminded me of someone I used to train with. Her, hair, her I didn't realize her fins are see-through. Yeah, I'm wondering if that's an oversight. Mm -hmm. Now I know you aren't just some wimpy loser. Oh, look at that smile. You're a wimpy loser with a big heart. Sorry, I, like, I get distracted by my mouse doing like this. <laughs> like down in the corner. I'm like, excuse me? Just like him. Mm. Listen, human... It seems that you and Asgore are fated to fight. But knowing him, he probably doesn't want to. Talk to him. I'm sure you can persuade him to let you go home. Eventually, some mean human will fall down here. And I'll take their soul instead. That makes sense, right? <laughs> oh. And if you do hurt Asgore, I'll take the human souls, cross the barrier, and beat the hell out of you. That's what friends are for, right? <laughs> <laughs> now let's get the hell out of this flaming house. Oh dear. <laughs> oh, God. Well, that was fun, huh? Burn down your house. Right. We'll have to hang out again some other time. But uh, somewhere else, I guess. We could go to Naps Blue's house. Right. In the meantime, I guess I'll go hang with Papyrus. So if you need me, drive by Snowden, okay? Oh, and if you ever need help, just give Papyrus a ring, okay? Since we're in the middle, it's in the same spot, I'll be able to talk too. Well, see you later, punk. Oh, wait! This is sudden, but... Can you deliver something for me? Papyrus suggested that I ask you. But he told me when I still hated you, so... Uh, anyway. Here, just take it. You got the Undyne... The Undyne's letter. Okay. Well, what are you waiting for? Go deliver it! Huh? Oh, uh, oh yeah. <laughs> It's addressed to Dr. Alpheus. Hmm. Okay, see you. Woo! Woo! Sounds like only fire lives here now. <laughs> Alright, you want to go back to Dr. Alpheus's place? Alright. Well, you definitely want to save. <laughs> that was, um... That was a thing, right? That was a massive thing. <laughs> and, and you know what? It's funny because I recently learned how to make Clemenza's spaghetti sauce from The Godfather. So I was like, oh, 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 I know what to do here. I know what to do. Oh, she's setting everything on fire. Never mind. <laughs> you take two big cans of crushed tomatoes and a can of tomato paste. Oh, there's the snails. We don't want to the go. The snails. There. We don't want to do the snails. No. Nope. All of my words. Sorry. What? The what? What? All of my words. Uh, Sharon Carpenter. Oh, it only. T Wait a minute. Hmm? Would it be quicker to take the boat, or should I go through the thing? No, you want you want to take the boat. Okay. Because <coughs> I think you take the boat to Hotland, and then you go up, and then to the right. Gotcha. Then we're off. There's a doggo boat. <laughs> It's Jesus, Jesus it's dog. so good. Timmy Village. The room before the darkening lantern room. Oh, I guess that's kind of like your subtle cue if you didn't figure it out already. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love the different boats. <laughs> Come again sometime. Tra la la. Tra la 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 la. Look for Cersei la. 
gender no neutral boat person. Right? Ah! The door has no mail slot. Slide the letter under. No, you keep the letter warm for a little longer. Oh, I thought I was gonna let me. You know, go inside the building! I guess not. You slide the letter in the door and give it a knock. Uh, uh, oh no. Is that another letter? I don't want to open it. Uh, can, can, can I just slide it back out? Uh, no, no, I can't keep doing this. I'll read this one. Um, it, it's shut kind of strongly, isn't it? Wait a second. Did you, did you just use a letter? Hey, if this is a joke, it's... Mm. Oh my god! Did you write this letter? It wasn't signed, so I had no idea who could have... Oh my god. Oh no. That's adorable! I had no idea you um wrote that way. It's surprising, too, after all the gross stuff I did. I don't really deserve to be forgiven. Much less, um... This? And it's so passionately, too. Oh. You know what? Okay, I'll do it. It's the least I can do to make it up to you. Yeah, yeah, let's go on a date. What have I gotten myself into? <laughs> Man, human, tiny human. Go! Oh! Dating start. Dating start! Uh oh, sorry, I'm still getting dressed. Oh my goodness. Uh, how do I look? Me on my dinner dates. Oh, wow. Lexi, I don't know if you've seen this scene. Swipe right. My friend helped me pick out this dress. She's got a great sense of. Um, anyway, let's do this thing. Dating start. Hey, hey, wait, 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 wait. Mm -hmm. Actually, uh, we can s can't start the date yet. Dating stop? <laughs> um, I've got to give you items to raise your affection statistic first. That'll increase the chance of successful outcome of the, to the date. Right? Aphrodisiac? <laughs> anyway, d don't worry, I'm prepared. I've been stockpiling gifts in anticipation for a date like this. Toriel, help me, I'm scared. <laughs> But first, I've got some metal armor polish. What? Uh, um, maybe you can't use that. But I also brought some waterproof cream for your scales. Your, um, scales. Um, well, how about this magical spear repair kit that I... Um... Hey, let's forget about the items. Let's just start the date. Dating start! Yeah, let's, uh, date. Hmm. Hmm. Um. Nah. Do you like anime? <laughs> anime is real, right? <laughs> anime is real. Is this is this is where this is going? This, is this is this where the meme came from? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, me too. Yeah. Hey, uh, let's g go somewhere. But where's a good place to go on a date? 
Oh. <laughs> Weave, how dare you? Settle down. <laughs> I got it. Gr 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 um, uh, Gribblies. Did I get it right this time? Gribblies? Gr uh, yay, I did it. Grillbees. Grill. Shit. Grillbees. Sorry. Sorry. Watch He's the language, grill. mister. I will never get that. Just... <laughs> the bees. place that papyri. What the? Let's go to the garbage dump. This is not going well. <laughs> Let's go be. Here we are. Let's go rummage for computer parts. Yeah. This is where Undyne and I come all the time. Phrasing. We find all sorts of stuff here. Hey, she's really... Uh... Uh... Oh, no. That's her over there! I can't let her see me on a date with you! Uh, why? Arby's? Right, yeah. We're, <laughs> we're going to Arby's. I'm going to Arby's. Get, get the meat mountain sandwich. How did I call it Garby's? Garby's. I call it Arby's Garby's. Why do you call it Garby's? This is garbage food. I can't oh, eat it. Oh, no! Because of corn dust everything. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> because, oh, well, oh, no, here she comes. I swear to God if she hides in the trash can. Okay, well. Hey, there you are. Punk rocker, Undyne. She let her hair down. Yeah, seriously. I uh, realized if you deliver that thing, it might be a bad idea. If you deliver the thing I gave you, you're in for a bad time. <laughs> so I'm gonna do it. Give it to me. Whoa. Huh? You don't have it. <laughs> Have you at least seen her? <laughs> oh, the shaking animation is real. <laughs> yes. So she's somewhere around here? Thanks. I'll keep looking. I don't know if you want to fuck corn domino. It's probably not good for you. Oh my god. That corn cob. Corn hub. <laughs> corn I, hub. Like this last, um, uh, April Fool's Day, they did a horn hub. Horn hub? Yeah, and it was like all people playing different instruments and like oh, goats and shit. Oh man. <laughs> That's pretty great. It was pretty great. Oh my god. Well, well it's obvious, huh? I, I, re I really like her. I mean, more than I like other people. I'm sorry. I just, I just figured, y you know. Vuvuzela. <laughs> oh dear. It'd be fu fun to go on a cute kind of pretend date with you, you know, to to make you feel better. No one wants to date you <laughs> for some reason. Nope, I'm undateable. They're all like, it's like the opposite problem of Link in Breath of the Wild. <laughs> Everyone yeah, wants to everybody me. wants to bone Link in Breath of the Wild. <laughs> it's Like, did you see, like, that journal entry of the one Sheikah girl? She's, I like, don't... she's talking about, like, her ladyhood is the equivalent of a bowstring being pulled back. It, it's, it, oh, God, it's crazy. Yeah, all it's, right. yeah, it's, it's like, yeah, rated uh, E10. Yeah, good job. Yeah. <laughs> With all this talk of corn, we're having an earful. Uh, didn't Pornhub do an April Fool's joke where they had a pop-up saying every video you watched was shared with people on Facebook? I That might have been something. I don't know. You know, there's a couple of those free streaming sites that actually have, like, the little post to Reddit, post to Twitter, post to Facebook. Who is actually using those to say, yo, check out this gangbang I found? I don't know. I imagine there's some probably porn-related uh, Facebooks that probably are like, Hey, this is a great photo. I, a great thing I found on porn, porn Hub. Yeah, what? look at this category film I have. <laughs> right. Mm -hmm. <sighs> well, it sounds even worse when I put it like that. 
I'm sorry, I messed up again. Undyne's the person I, um, really want to go on a date with. But, I mean, she's way out of my league. N not that you aren't, um, cool. But, but Undyne... She's so confident and strong and funny. And I'm just a nobody. A fraud. I'm the royal scientist, but... <laughs> Joe says he found the entire Flintstones WWE movie at Port of One. <laughs> Remember when Gaijin Goomba was posting his videos on, on like, Red oh, Tube or something yeah. like that, and he was getting views, like, out the ass? Literally! Gaijin goes to Japan, gets fucked in ass, and it's all- oh, oh, Jesus. All I've ever done is hurt people. I've told her so many lies. She thinks I'm... She thinks I'm a lot cooler than I actually am. If she gets close to me, she'll... She'll find out the truth about me. Eh. What should I do? The truth? But if I tell her that, she'll hate me! Will she? Isn't it better this way? To live a lie where both people are happy? Or a truth where neither of us are? It's exhausting to keep telling a lie. They say, be yourself. But I don't really like who myself is. I'd rather just be whatever makes people like me. Oh, this is striking <laughs> a chord. <laughs> this game's too real, man. Yeah, it is. <laughs> mm. Mm. No, you're right. Every day I'm scared. Every day I'm shuffling. Scared what will happen to people when the truth on their own. They'll all get hurt because of me. But how can I tell Undyne the tr the truth? I don't don't have the confidence. I'm gonna mess it up. How can I practice? Options are roleplay or roleplay. Ro roleplay? Uh, uh, that actually sounds kind of fun. <laughs> okay, which one of us will be Undyne? Obviously. <laughs> Hi, Undyne. How are you doing today? <laughs> You're cute. Wait a minute! It's spelled wrong! <laughs> it's possessive! <laughs> You're the possessive of cute. I'm gonna do that just because of the bad grammar. Oh my God. The, the thanks. No, no, you're taking it wrong. It's. You say it to me a lot, and I never know what to say. But I know you just mean it platonically because we're just friends. <laughs> um, so I'd like to um talk to you about something. That's right, grammar banana. Where's DK? Do I need a? Do I need to bring out Bob Dole? Yeah, you're right. <laughs> oh my god. Then she kisses you. <laughs> uh, what? What? And I would never. Uh. Mm. I kiss her back so softly. This is awkward as hell. I uh, I uh, look gently into her eyes. I start hollering. <laughs> 
The music is freaking out! <laughs> Vinny, this is so... I don't even know what's going on! I'm dying! I'm dying! I love you! Oh my god, what is happening? <laughs> I'm dying! Kiss me again! I'm dying! <laughs> what did you just say? I'm done! I'm done! No, no more! That's it. <laughs> Stop it! Settle down! You're the oh. one who got her start harloing. I... This is... It's all your fault. <laughs> this, this is all goat mom help me. I'm freaking out. Uh, and I, I was just. Uh, hey, whoa. Wait a second. Your outfit's really cute. What's the occasion? Uh, wait a second. Are you two? On a date? Uh, yes. Oh, no. I mean, uh, no. I mean, we were, but I mean, actually, we were only romantically role playing as you. What? I mean. Uh, you mean uh, hey. I mean, uh, Undyne, I, uh, I've been lying to you. Oh, dear. Nope, Vinny, I've sobered up, sorry. What? About what? About, well, everything. I told you that seaweed was like scientifically important and I just really use it to make ice cream. And those human history books I keep reading, those are just dorky comic books. And the history movies, those, those are just, um, anime. They aren't real. And the time I told you I was busy with work on the phone, I was just eating frozen yogurt in my pajamas that time. Elvius. I just wanted to be impressed you. I just wanted you to think I was smart and cool. I'm... That I wasn't some nerdy loser. Alpheus. I'm dying. I really think you're neat, okay? Alpheus. Shh. Shh. <laughs> oh. She put her in the slaver hold! <laughs> By God! Alpheus had a family! Someone get the ref in there! <laughs> Elvis, I think you're neat, too, I guess. But you gotta realize. Most of what you said really doesn't matter to me. Press F Why don't you fucker put, put her in a... Fucking... Na nothing but net. I don't yeah. care if you're watching kid cartoons or reading history books. To me, all that stuff is just nerdy crap. Oh dear. What I like about you is that you're passionate. You're analytical. It doesn't matter what it is, you care about it. 100% at maximum power. So, you don't have to lie to me. I don't want you to have to lie to anyone anymore. Alpheus, I want to help you become happy with who you are. And I know just the trending you need to do that. What nice. is even happening? You. You're gonna train me? <laughs> what? Me? <laughs> oh no. Nah. Let me get Papyrus to do it. Get those bones shaking! Please play Bone Trussle. It's time to jog 100 laps, hooting about how great we are. Please play Bone Trussle. Ready? I'm about to start the timer. And I'm... 
I'll do my best. Or not. That's cool, too, I guess. Friend oh. zoned? Oh! God. And the music is... She was kidding, right? Those cartoons, those comics, those are still real, right? Enemies, real, right? Oh! Tom, look at her face. Look at her face, Tom. Oh, oh no! Tom. I am terrified! Tom. To live a lie, or to tell the truth. No. No. I can feel my heart breaking into pieces. Did you say anime is real? Anime is not real. <gasps> can't, Tom. I'm sorry. What? Shelby! Shelby! Amy is real, Tom! Amy is real! <laughs> no. I can survive this. I have to be strong. <laughs> For Alpheus. Thank you, human, for telling me the truth. There goes the true ending. What? <laughs> I'll try my best to live in this world. See you later. That's not true, is it? I think he's joking. I hope is that so. Elba is jabated. Get, <laughs> get the fuck out of here, you jabater. Language! Okay, so that was the thing. Oh, we're back down here again. Yeah, you're in the trash. Piles of garbage. There are quite a few brands you recognize. Just garbage, like myself. Yo. <laughs> Am I gonna fight the training dummy again? No. Partaking in worthless garbage fills you with determination. I think you need to go back to the lab. Are they gonna be boning? Um, fish boning? <laughs> Bone fish. <laughs> How am I feeling? Uh, better. Did I see the archive of the game day? No, I did not. I was still pretty loopy. So I kind of went to bed, kind of went to bed early. There... So, um... Oh. Telefono. I've been joking, I've been making like a small joke about my, um... I have, I have a... Canopy of stuffed animals above my bed. Yes. Um, I've been joking that like one night, it's gonna happen where all of them come crashing down and on their fluffy glory upon my head. And then you're going to wake up and you're going to be like, this is true comfort. I, I think I'd wake up scared. No. <laughs> you know, because, you know, not expecting it. Right? Um. So it finally happened. It, I didn't happen oh. quite like that. <laughs> I was trying to make my bed and I uh, one of them fell out. And I was like, oh, dang. And then like a bunch of them fell out. And then and it just, all, they all fell out. And I was like, God damn it. Ca cavalcade of, of stuffed animals. Come on back. Howdy! If it isn't my good friend who trust me. Oh dear. This is Papyrus, your also mutual friend. Alpheus and I finished our training early. Very early. Oh dear. So I sent her home. Very home. Uh, now. I feel strongly and for no apparent reason. You should also go there. To her lab house. I have only good feelings about this. Good goodbye. <laughs> okay. Calming tranquility. Mm -mm 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 -mm. 
One of the worst things to do is to wake up all your life by your bed's legs breaking. That sounds awful. That is pretty bad. And the house is still on fire. Oh, fire's going to live there now. Fire has moved in. And Vinny says you should check your Twitter. Okay. Oh, I went a minute. I should also... Different boat. Try to lie. Care for a ride? Ride in the boat. Snowden! <laughs> oh man, I was tucked in and happy. Oh man, I was so happy. Oh, from from uh the, sh the Texas shindig. Yes. Yeah, that was pretty great. <laughs> Don't Don't snoop behind people's houses. What? You might be mistaken for a trash can. Ooh. Oh, okay. All right. Come again sometime, Shalala. I wish I had some tea. It'd be pretty great. I need to make some. It's a note from Alpheus. Read it. I don't read it because of the handwriting, but you try your best. Hey. Thanks for your help back there. You guys, your support really means a lot to me. But, as difficult as it is to say this, you guys alone can't magically make my own problems go away. I want to be a better person. I don't want to be afraid anymore. And for that to happen, I have to be able to face my own mistakes. I'm going to start doing that now. I want to be clear. This isn't anyone else's problem but mine. But if you don't ever want to hear from me again, if you want to know the truth, enter the door to the north of this note. You all at least deserve to know what I did. That's all she wrote. Elevator? Elevator? Oh! War warning! Elevator losing power. EM tether stability lost. Altitude dropping. Bad. <sighs> okay. Hmm. Welcome to the other lab. This looks like some stuff straight out of Mad Father. This doesn't look good. Entry number one. This is it. Time to do what the king has asked me to do. I will create the power to free us all. I will unleash the power of the soul. Entry number two. The barrier is locked by soul power. Unfortunately, this power cannot be retreated, recreated artificially. Soul power can be only derived from what was once living. So, to create more, we must ha we will have to use what we have now. The souls of monsters. Oh dear. Entry number three. But extracting a soul from a living monster would require an incredible power. Besides being impractical, doing so would instantly destroy the soul's host. And, unlike the persistent souls of humans, the souls of most monsters disappear immediately upon death. If only I could make a monster's soul last. Entry number five. I've done it. Using the blueprints, I've extracted it from the human souls. I believe this is what gives their souls the strength to persist after death. They will, the will to keep living, the resolve to change fate. Let's call this power Determination. Oh dear. I 
kills you with determination. The true lab. It's a fake plant. Therefore, there's a note on the ground. You can't make it all out. Elevator. Lost power. Enter the center door. That's all you could read. Power room. Buy chips for 25G. Entry number six. Askor asked everyone else at the city for monsters that had fallen down. Their bodies came in today. They're still comatose, and soon they'll all turn into dust. But what happens if I inject determination into them? If their souls persist after they perish, then... The freedom might be closer than we all thought. The name of the song on the official soundtrack is called Here We Are. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I just opened it up, actually. Entry number nine. We just skipped a bunch. Things aren't going well. None of the bodies have turned into dust, so I can't get their souls. I told the families that I would give them the dust back for the funerals. People are starting to ask me what's happening. What do I do? It's some kind of operating table. It's sticky. Uh... Yeah, check the sinks. You turned on the sink. Turned on the sink. You turned on the sink. Oh dear. Oh dear. Blank drew near. You take out your cell phone. You can hear the voices through the receiver. Come join the fun. This isn't fun! But nobody came. No one was saved. No one came. Memory head? You'll be with us shortly. Lorem ipsum doset. But nobody came. That's a shame. Become one of us. Ouch. Seems like it doesn't care anymore. There's a red key lying in the sink. You took it and put it in your keychain. 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 There's a note on the ground. You can't make it all out. Drain. Dropped it. That's all you can read. Click. The red key fits perfectly into the slot. So... This, did you ever, are you familiar with uh, the game Mad Father? Mm -mm. Okay, it's a uh, RPG maker horror game. Mm -hmm. And you're playing as the daughter of a mad scientist. But the thing is, she doesn't know that her father is a mad scientist. It sounds really familiar. Uh, Nitro Red did an excellent video on it, but basically the hook of it is... He's not a bad guy. Genuinely, he is not a bad guy, but he does bad things because he believes that they are the right things. Mm -hmm. That's what all of this is. That's what seemingly everything is going on in this monster realm. Everybody is doing what they perceive to be the right thing, but they are de genuinely bad things. 
this is this is treading in such dangerous territory right now. Because Papyrus is clearly not a bad guy. He just wants to be respected and join the guard, but his initial approach to catching a human is like catching a wild animal that can't be tamed. You know? Mm. And as he meets you, everything's fine. Oh, I see what's going on here. Okay. Did I make tea in here? I think I could make tea in here. Do you have a kettle? I have an electric kettle. Put the kettle on. Gerardo has dubbed that picture of you the Rurito. I it's think we've, Rurito with extras. I think we've done that before. You alright, Toriel? We'll just go ahead and wait for her to come back. Oh, I hear. I hear it. Uh, this is about to turn into Resident Evil. That's a ghost. What? Tom, what are you doing? I'm about to get the bad touch from this ghost. Tom, no! He's gonna touch you. He'll bind you, Tom. Oh! Oh, 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 aww. Pat, Pat. Everything's okay. Was, uh, Go, I was gonna say it looks like a, kind of like a boner. Yeah. I was uh, just wondering. Uh, and, and then you get out of bed really quick. What happens if I do it again? Does a does a little ghost guy come back? Yeah. Oh, he does. How nice. If you ever want to see me, oh, she's gone again. Whoops. I'm making bad decisions. Bad life decisions? Oh, no. I've made an even worse one. Whoop. Hello? Hi there. <laughs> Here's my electric kettle. <laughs> oh, nice. I like the pattern on it. I'm gonna put on the floor near all my electronics. And I'm gonna turn it on. <laughs> what did you unplug for the kettle? My heating pad? I got some I got some rock sugar in here going on. And then I've got some honey lavender stress relief, which is something I think I should drink. Mm. Golden flowers. Anything happen while I was gone? I was reading some journal entries. All the monsters that have fallen down are waking back up like nothing was ever wrong. The determination is not working out. 
Entry number seven. Oh, now we're starting to get the missing logs. We'll need a vessel to wield the monster souls when the time comes. After all, a monster cannot absorb the souls of other monsters, just as a human cannot absorb a human soul. So then, what about something that's neither human nor monster? Like a robot. Oh dear. Me me meta me metal Metatron? Metaton. Yeah. Experiments on vessels are a failure. It doesn't seem to be any different from the control cases. Whatever. They're hassle to work with anyway. The seeds just stick to you and won't let go. Oh dear. Oh, oh my. This look familiar? It's a it's a burb. Mm-hmm. Do you hear that? Oh, this one? Oh dear. True terror. Yeah, this is uh. Yeah, this one's pretty creepy. You wash your hands. Nothing happened. What? Oh. Oh. Oh, no. What in the world? Yeah, I remember this one. <laughs> this, so see how this is like a combination of different, of different enemies? It's like, it's like a bird, but it's also the eyeball guy? Mm. You kneel and pray for safety. Remember, it's blanket remembers its conscience. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Mm. Try pick on. Or hum. You hum a familiar tune, but no one heard you. Huh? Well, never mind. What are you afraid of? Oh dear. Yeah. This is this is one of the worst ones, in my opinion. You did something mysterious. He recognizes it has more to learn from this world. Jesus. Just gonna spit locusts at me. <laughs> like it's the goddamn mummy. Maybe try not pick on the queen. And just like that, the water's done. Nice. That you pick was on fast. Reaper Bird. Reaper Bird seems to remember something. Something fine gets it. Oh, Ribbit. it's three berries Courage. in one. Yeah. Yeah. So electric kettles, um, despite the fact that like they're like meh, it's great. Seems placated. Congrats. Uh, any experience with the 360 Mad Cat Street Fighter 4 sticks? I actually have the original Street Fighter 4 arcade stick. I, uh, after watching the How To with Chad, I got the, uh, octagonal, uh, restrictor gate and put that in there after getting an Allen wrench set. So I thought that was great. I also have the Marvel vs. Capcom 2 stick, which is what I use for pretty much everything. There's a note on the ground. Can't make it all out. Cold. That's all you can read. It's some sort of, sort of switch. There's a blue colored slot in the center. But I don't have the key! You gotta look for something cold. Got golden flowers. Dude, Joe, get it. They're great. They're really, really great. And, uh... There's a little, like, dongle thing that you can get to make it work on a, on an Xbox One. I uh, believe uh, L and uh, Wordman have those. Remember, injury number 15. Seems like this research was at a dead end. 
But at least we got a happy ending out of it. What? I sent the souls back to Asgore, returned the vessel to its his garden. And I called all of the families and told them everyone's alive. I'll send everyone back tomorrow. Smiley face. Okay. Freeze the key, pal key, right? Metal gear. <laughs> It's quiet. Entry number 11. Now that the Metatons made it big, he never talks to me anymore. Oh dear. Except to ask when I'm going to finish his body. But I'm afraid if I finish his body, he won't need me anymore. Then we'll never be friends ever again. Not to mention, every time I try to work on it, I just get really sweaty. Hidden boss fight. There's a switch on the wall. Press it. Oh dear. Oh dear. Emily. It's got five legs. Mm hmm. What are you going to do? What I can do. It's the Agamalite game light. Pet play back and ignore. Amaglai is too far away to pet. You just pet the air. Oh dear. Amaglai is watching intently. Beckon. You call the Amagalite. Am Amalgamate? It bounced towards you, flecking a strange liquid from an orifice. Oh dear! Hovering close, looking for affection. You pet the Amagalite. It convulses rapidly, then calms down. It rests quietly on your lap for the moment. Suddenly, it shoots away, crawling wildly on the walls. Amalg Amalgamate. Amalgamate. Striking the wall with his claws. See how it's like his legs are also the shadow of dogs? Mm. Play! You throw your weapon into the corner of the room. He brings it back to you. Proudly? You repeat this process a few times. Now Magame is very tired. He leans his dripping, amorphous body on you. Rocket! Rocket dog! Ow! Stop it! It's twitching affectionately. You eat the dog salad. It's literally garbage. HP is maxed out. Oh, so close. Ow, ow. Maybe a pet again? Strange one happiness froth. Stage one happiness froth. It's getting gross. How am I supposed to avoid that? Mm -hmm. It's rude. You pet decisively. The amalgamate seems to be satisfied by all this. And the dog music just started playing. <laughs> In Endogeny is content. Endogeny? Endogeny? <laughs> Stage Ooh. one happiness froth will be playing at Gabe's tonight. No. Hey! Cut -cut -cut. You know what? You just made the list! Mm -hmm. Okay, but there's... I found nothing. Go touch the switch again, maybe? Maybe? No. Oh. I don't know.
He depends oh, on him for the next room. Alright, do ra ra Do ra ra ra. I think you read that one too. Did you? No, 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 no. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, this is ominous. Hmm. Oh, I'm I'm walking really slow for some reason. Hmm. It's going fast. Party hard. Oh, there's a green house key or a key leaning in the bathtub. You took it and put it in your keychain. It's an empty bathtub. Okay. <laughs> that was the thing. That was not You got cool. tricked. That's uh, not okay. It smells like sweet lemons. You flexed your arm. Lemon bread's muscles shake. Welcome to my special hell. Oh! It smells like sweet lemons. See, this is like a this is a mold mold big and um, the siren thing and the flex guy. You let lemon bread be. Lemon bread's teeth shake. That's what they all say. You gotta start, like, when it goes up, you gotta start moving up. And towards the center. Oh, she's gonna get hit by the new teeth. Uh, maybe unhug or cry or something? Cried as loud as you could. Nobody came. But nobody came. Oh! Oh dear. Tasty Abby. Uh, <clears throat> Pun hug? Oh, did. screamed out. Nobody came. Do you think I'm pretty? You hum a familiar tune. Lemon bread seems to remember something. I felt this before. Damn it! Could this be goodbye? You won. Flex seal, right? You cried as loud as you could, but nobody came. It could be a many Tom's Tom sex life joke that you'll say for a Cards Against Humanity game day, Kappa. That is so savage that I can't help but be impressed that you got that. DT extraction machine. Status? Inactive. De determination. Mm hmm There's a note on the ground. You can't make it all out. Under sheets. That's what all you could read. Did you did you get the yellow key? Not yet. It's a, few, it's a VHS player with a couple something labeled in a specific order. Will you watch one? Psst, Chloe, wake up. Mm hmm. What is it, dear? Uh. Why do you have that video camera? Shh. I wanted to get your reaction. Gory, dearest. What is my favorite vegetable? Hmm. Carrots, right? No, no, no. My favorite vegetable is... Edamame. Okay. Get it? Gory. Go back to bed, dear. 
No, no, not yet. <laughs> now, if I were a dog, what breed of dog would I be? Hmm, I don't know, honey. What kind of dog would you be? I would be... a Mamaranian. So this is Toriel and Asgore. <laughs> oh ho 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 ho! You sure are excited to have this child. You know, if you keep making jokes like this, one day you could be a famous Marmedian. Oh dear. Well, I'm going to bed. Hey, come on, Tori. That was one. That one was funny. Haha, <laughs> I know. I'm just teasing you. Good night, dear. Good night, honey. Oh dear, perhaps it's too dark in here for the video to come out. Mm. Want some more backstory? That's only number one. Cartoons of some kind, oh boy. Seem to be off to safe for a few stray. Sticky ones? Oh! <laughs> Choose a tape to watch. Okay, Jenna, are you ready? Do your creepy face. Ah! <laughs> Oh, wait, I had the lens cap on. What? You're not gonna do it again? Come on, quit tricking me. <laughs> what? When did that happen? She's a tape to watch. Howdy, Jenna. Smile for the camera. Ha, this time I got you. I left the cap on. On purpose. Now you're smiling for no reason. <laughs> what? Oh, yeah, I remember. When we tried to make butterscotch pie for Dad, right? The recipe asked for cups of butter. But we accidentally put in butter cups instead. Yeah, those flowers got him really sick. I felt so bad. We made Mom really upset. I should have laughed it off, like you did. Um, anyway, where are you going with this? Huh? Turn off the camera? Okay. What is happening? Howdy, Jenna. Have I How been here before and I just don't remember? Is this not the first time? I... I don't like this idea, Jenna. What? What? No, no, I'm not. Big kids don't cry. Yeah, you're right. No, I'd never doubt you, Jenna. Never. It, yeah, we'll be strong. We'll free everyone. I'll go get the flowers. Jenna, can you hear me? We want you to wake up. Jenna, you have to stay determined. You can't give up. You are the future of humans and monsters. Oh, dear. I'm the vessel. Psst, Jenna, please, wake up. I don't like this plan anymore. I... I... No, I said... I said I'd never doubt you. Six, right? We just have to get six. And we'll do it together, right? <laughs> you were the tropes of one, Jenna. You were supposed to unite the monsters, not destroy them! Flowey has the high ground. <laughs> Fuck Flowey, sorry, sorry, sorry. Language! There's a TV over there on the side you didn't get. Oh, that's true. 
Entry number four. I've been researching humans to see if I can find any info about their souls. I ended up snooping around the castle and found these weird tapes. I don't feel like Asgore's watched them. I don't think he should. Mm. This one was just no no oh yeah. Yeah, the machine. Oh, it's cold in here. Entry number 19. The families keep calling me to ask where everyone is coming home. What am I supposed to say? I don't even answer the phone anymore. It's a refrigerator. It's empty. It's a refrigerator. It seems to contain samples of some, some kind. Entry number 20. That refrigerator shakes. Shook. Asgore left me five messages today. Four about everyone being angry. What about this cute teacup he found that looks like me? Thanks, Asgore. It's a refrigerator. It's empty. Where is it? Entry number 21. I spend all my time at the garbage shop now. Oh. It's my element. It's a refrigerator. It seems to contain samples of some kind. It's a refrigerator. It's empty. Good time! It's so cold. Malgamate. You said something like, You look horrible. Why are you even alive? What? You didn't say that? Snowy. It's so cold. You told a bad pun about snow. Her expression starts to shift. <sighs> I remember. You laugh and keep laughing. It's so funny. You can't stop. Tears run down your face. What? You didn't do that? Snowy. Make another joke. Tell the bad pun about snow. Her expression changes more. <laughs> Thank you. Try again, more jokes. Told a bad pun about snow. She's completely calmed down. You won. There we go. You found a blue key on the ground. You can put it on your keychain. Sweet. There's a note on the floor, on the ground. You can't make it all out. Curtain. That's all you could read. Click! The green key fits perfectly in the slot. The refrigerator is going to chase you! It's going to be like the end of Witch's House. Yeah. I was watching that again the other day. Oh yeah? Yeah. It was just like like you're you're you're, you're it's like one word is like, no, nah, I don't wanna do it. It's like, no, this is it, you can do it, Shelby, and, and you got it. It was great. Yeah. Oh man. The flower part is like the worst. You gotta remember like what to do. Mm-hmm. You're like so far. Yup. Game is brutal. It is brutal. And I think this is a very good place to call it for right now. Because things are getting weird. Mm -hmm. Really? Next really? time will probably be the final, the finale. Really? Yep. Okay. Really. This is. Uh... So plan on that. I don't know how long it's gonna be. It just depends on how you take the rest of the game. But um, I would have um a another something lined up afterwards. Oh, as a as as a filler. Yeah. Gotcha. Please understand. That's right. Cool. I should be home next Sunday by the time we need to start stream, but I will keep you updated. Okay. I'm supposed to go to a baseball game. Baseball, major league or minor? Uh, it's softball, and I think it's college. Nice. Coleg. Coleg yeah. so softball. Coleg ball. I'm going to go meet my sister for the first time. So, oh, oh, nice. 
yeah. Windsweeper. I have. I know what we could do. As, as do you? Yeah, killing floor. <laughs> oh. Yeah, kick it at old school. Go, go, go and dust off your firebug gear. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, right. Cool. All right. So, yeah, ba baseball. That is cool. Baseball. Domino says, you have a sister? She has many sisters. I do have many sisters, actually. One of them is getting probably getting a divorce. Oh. Oops. It happens. It's part of life. Yeah, I mean, I I shouldn't voice my opinions. Oh. This has been one of several breakups, that's all I will really say. Oop, well. Yeah. Mm. They've uh they've they've pulled it apart and put it back together and pulled it apart and put it back together and pulled it apart and put it back together. And sometimes it's just time to move on. You gotta well, they're both kids. Oh, so. that probably doesn't help either. No. <laughs> They got married, I think, when she was 19, 18 or 19. Oops! Yeah. And there was supposed to be a ceremony. Like, I was invited to the wedding. And then they went ahead and got married. So they like invited me, I think it was in, like, in March. And then they ended up getting married in February at the Justice of the Peace. And I was like, why? And I was like, I was asked her, I was like, why? She's like, well, I thought we'd just save money. And we're going to take that money together and have a ceremony later on this year. Never happened. Whatever. If you can't, I this is my thing. I'm not necessarily like a wedding. Like, I gotta have a wedding. Mm -hmm. I gotta have a wedding. Mm -hmm. But if we're gonna spend the rest of our, if we're gonna, if we're gonna suffer through the rest of our life in monogamy together, mm -hmm. we better do something like throw a party for people we know or whatever. And like, if you can't commit to that kind of like commitment, mm -hmm. don't get married. Yeah. I mean, to each their own. I know that um, many people have made it just as the peace, and that's a okay because they're like, just the peace, and then we're gonna take our money and go on a honeymoon. Mm -hmm. I get it. I totally get it. But if you can't commit to a, you know, a ceremony or like a party or like a gathering of families, don't get married. Just don't. Yeah. <laughs> don't waste your money or time. So it's whatever. And Vinny says, "Have a party at Discovery Zone." Yeah. Oh my god, I used to love Discovery Zone. It's yeah. my favorite place. They don't have them anymore, right? No. Anybody know where they went or why? Not cool. Discovery Zone is greater than what? It yeah. Yeah, I'd go to Discovery. Dude, there should be an adult. Dis I think there is dis adult Discovery Zones, aren't there? Almost. I don't. I need like an adult sized be. like padded jungle gym. That's what I I would love that. that would It'd probably smell better too. Yeah. Be pretty dope. Be cool to have like this big crawling stuff, and you can like find these little pockets, and you can come in there and like there's like a bar and one, and like that'd be. Yeah, and then and then <sighs> you come out and then try to go on the monkey bars after you've had three drinks. <laughs> Look, like, the monkey <laughs> bars would be over like a, a foam cube pit. <laughs> oh, okay. So that way, if you yeah. Fall, if you fall flat it's on your face, it's not mm -hmm. gonna it's not gonna kill you. No, and everyone's signing fucking waivers, okay? <laughs> Everybody's signing waivers every day they're shuffling. Right on. So, what you got going on this week? Mm, well, <sighs> Wednesday's a toss-up. I don't know what's happening Wednesday because, like, work RPG is not panning out. Oh, dear. And I can't get more than two people to show up to... Um, the stuff, which is really bad, and I don't know if that's because like nobody's interested anymore, or the business is just that busy, and they just want they can't play anymore. So um, Wednesday will be a toss up. Uh, we will be playing Arc the Thursday. Arc the Thursday. Arc the Thursday. And you got and that then, up and running without a, and without any problems. Right. I, I downloaded it for the PS4, so... Um, oh, well, that'll take all the guesswork out of it, won't it? Well, I just... It's one of those things that, like, I was thinking about, like... Man, if I run it on the PS2, I have it already. If I run it on the PS2, it'll run fine. It'll look 
PS2-ish. But then syncing the sound was going to be like a literal nightmare. Mm. Because I can delay my camera. That's fine. I can delay my mic. That's fine. I can't delay Matt. <laughs> no, and that was a problem with using the legacy devices. There was, you had to figure out the delay. And if you had anybody on Skype, you would be predicting the future. Yeah. Yeah. So, so yeah. I just decided to, you know, um, buy it on PS4 and then I can use the Elgato HD HD and then I don't have a problem. It's then, in time don't have to worry about it. Yeah, pretty much. I'm going to eventually have to get a new, um, a new cable for my Elgato. Cause like I've run over it with my chair and broke the shielding. <sighs> the USB cable. Uh huh. Um, not the not the device. It's just the cable. I've... No, 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 no. The thing is, I tried getting a longer USB Type C cable for it. Mm -hmm. It never worked. Like I don't know if there's a certain length that it can't be over, or if there is a very specific kind of USB Type C cable that Elgato provided. Hmm. Because I bought two different USB Type C cables, and neither of them worked. Interesting. Yeah, so I, um, yeah. Tom, my life in gaming is streaming a way out when you're streaming that with Clay. I gotta talk to Clay, because he, he had to go to camp. So when he gets back from camp, I, I will talk to camp? him. Camp? Yeah, he, uh, they have property up in the backwoods of Pennsylvania that they need to maintain and everything, so. Uh, he calls it camp? It, it, it literally is a campground that, oh. they, that they rent out to people, so. And it has cabins and all that fun stuff. We gotta go to Clay Camp! Exactly, Clay Camp. Yes, Can yes, Domino. The HD 60 S's use USB Type-C on one end, and then it's a full-size USB Type-A on the other end. So, yep. Yeah. Yup. So, yeah, Clay Camp. Spelled with a, with a C, capital mm -hmm. C, because it's funnier that way. It's also spelled correctly that way, too. I just realized I killed my own joke. So, anyways, that, that that's work. Camp Clay. Well, Crazy Camp spelled with a K because that makes it silly. Yeah, because yeah. we're crazy kooky. Yep, exactly. What Can about we... you? What you got going on? Yep. Since so... you're back in sobriety. So, back in sobriety in full force. So, we got Fallout Monday, tomorrow. Um, we... I uh, <laughs> Vinny kind of was guiding me through this thing and then he realized about halfway when i was clearing this this foundry it's like yeah i just realized there's a boss fight in the next room you might want to save and i'm like oh oops <laughs> so mm. so uh i've got a quest item in my inventory that i kind of want to wrap up because it doesn't it's not tremendously heavy but i can't take it out of my inventory and put it somewhere else so we got to wrap that up and return this item to somebody else. And then um, Tuesday, we're on Platformer Tuesday. We're going to probably wrap up Super Lucky's Tale with the Gilly Island DLC, which has been delightful. But it was um, there's a greater margin of error when playing a game like Fallout versus a 3D platformer. So last week, I didn't even bother trying playing Lucky mm. in my depleted state. And that was probably <laughs> for the best. Because I probably would have been falling off cliffs. When's Shrek? When I finish Lucky. Okay. That well, Originally we were going to do Shrek immediately after finishing uh, Poi. And then the DLC for Lucky came out. And I'm like, no, I have to cleanse my palate of Poi. Because Poi was a thing. And I needed a palate cleanser. So I went back to something that I knew that I was going to enjoy. And that was Lucky. Which is hard. Like, boy oh boy, did they ramp up the difficulty on that one. You're really like maxing out your double jump for all it's worth, which is, which mm. is, which is definitely a thing. Um, and then uh, Friday, uh, we will. Oh, um, I think we'll be doing Sea of Thieves again if we can get the entire pirate crew together. Either that, or we'll probably do, I don't know, Halo Five and Warzone Firefight or something like that. And don't forget, G One Game Days is Saturday. I'll be doing Titanfall Two. Uh, mm. re remember, robots are people too. Um, they are. Yes. They're beautiful, and, beautiful, catching people. Yeah, exactly. And they give you a thumbs up and then I cry because like he learned how to do that for me. <laughs> you know, it's it was, it, it's great. It's got grappling hooks and it's fun and it's great. Well, we could do D&D &D if we get enough people together, but we'll see what's going on. So that's what we got going on this week. So 
Yay! Hope to see you all there in the streams We're doing the things. Awesome. Right. So, cool, cool. Cool, cool. And oh. then definitely we'll be back here Sunday. Well, hopefully we'll be back here Sunday. I'll keep you updated. Yep. Indeed. You might be out on Friday. That's fine. Because of it. Oh, that's right. Avengers is. Oh, right. yeah, that's right. I think. So I saw Isle of Dogs with Thompson this past Friday. Oh, yeah. Which was funny because we were planning all week and he's like, there's no showings. There's no showings except for at this ritzy, fancy pants theater that takes itself way too fucking seriously. Which by the time we went to go look, there's actually more. So like on Tuesday, there was like showings. But on Friday, there was no showings except for at this place. So we just went to that place. We went to go have dinner at Ramen. And then um, when we got there, so it's 420. Of course. I think all these staff was participating in 420 because, oh, like, no. I tried to, I was like, they like, we had to pick our seats. And I was like, well, I want E6. I want E6. And then he'll buy E7, basically. Mm -hmm. And they clicked it and it didn't, wouldn't click E6. It clicked E7 instead. And it was, he was, they were like, I think it was a girl. And she was like, oh, yeah, it, this is one ago. You're just going to have to, sorry. It's like, you can sit at E6, but like, you'll have a ticket for E7. And I'm like, but what if someone comes and they got E6? Like, uh, but she's like, I can't, I can't do anything. I literally can't even. I, I know. <laughs> I smoked a bowl. I can't fix it. I'm sorry. And then I, I come inside and she goes, have you guys been here before? And I'm like, no. And she's like, theaters are upstairs. You'll be in theater four. I'm like, what the, can I have whatever you're smoking? Cause you're having a great time. <laughs> It, it's it, fucking yeah, insane. It, it, yeah, devil's latusi. But um, the Isle of Dogs was pretty good. I've we'll heard say. great things about that. It's very interesting. Like Shoot. the art style. I have a crush on you. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Go, Mom! Yes. Cool, cool. I that'll do it for us tonight. We'll Good see night, you on everybody. the flip side. So keep your eyes and ears on the Twitter machine for what's going on next. And beautiful swimsuit photos. That's right, yes. Internet breaking swimsuit photos. Between you and, and Kelly, you guys are you're burning the goddamn house down. It's it's fantastic. It's swimsuit season, Tom. Is it really? Yeah. That's fantastic. You don't expect to see any of me because I will break the internet for the wrong reason. <laughs> Although, if, if you ask Sean Madden real nicely, he might dust off that screw attack speedo. So there oh, my go. God, please. That'd be yeah, great. That would be. All right. That's going to do it for us. Uh, and on that note, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you on the flip side. Ric Flair, take us home. Read what you want to read. Believe what you want to believe. But go to bed. That's right. Go to bed. Good night, everybody. Ciao, ciao. Good night. Bye-bye.